All right, everybody, welcome back to our next episode of our voice flow prompt chaining tutorial. So let's recap what we've done. We've built a little restaurant assistant here. That's for a cowboy restaurant that the conversation will just keep going and going until we say we want to quit. And then we'll just be told, thanks for coming. See you later. Now, the challenge here is that every time you want to do this, LLM based intent detection. So we have this quit detection block here. We need to keep adding more blocks to it. So in our loop, we just need to keep stacking these blocks and adding if conditions. And as we saw before, actually getting this condition to work reliably can be quite tricky. So what we're going to do today is combine a more traditional NLU model with our LLMs to make a better experience. So let's go ahead and just rename this. Forgot to do it last time, detection. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab an event here, drag out an intent step. So an intent in conversational design is when the user wants to accomplish a certain action or, or intent. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some examples to it. So we're gonna create a new intent. We're gonna call it ready to order. Now the fun thing here that we have in voice though is we can actually generate some examples using a large language model. So we're going to generate some examples here that we're going to use to, to train our model. Okay, those all look good. I'm going to hit create intent. Now what's going to happen is that as we're going through and looping through a conversation, when the user says something like ready to order, we're going to go ahead and jump to that block and then do something else. So we're going to say here, all right, can I help you with this? This is, we'll just call this order confirmation or something. And let's just see how this works. So what we need to do before running our, our prototype now is because we have that intent step, we need to train our NLU. So we're going to go ahead and run this training function. So what this is going to do is it's going to train a small specialized model for detecting all the intents that we have. In this case, uh, we just have one intent. So for all intents and purposes, it should take long. So <laughs> let, let, let's go ahead and run our test now. So we're going to go through and loop through our conversation design. So we're going to go here say what's on the menu. I'm just talking to our assistant. They're going to tell us something fun. Okay, uh, and let's say I want to order BBQ roots. Now as you can see here, we jump to our ready to order function, our intent, and now we can execute this line of uh, flows. So that's how we can combine large language models and NLUs. It helps to keep our canvas a little bit cleaner and more organized, and we can have specialized NLU models to accomplish our intent detection goals. So next time, we're going to talk about another NLU function called entity extraction, and how can we can, and how we can use LLMs to, to accomplish that. Till next time.